I'll do it for you, I do it for the novelty. Hey yo, it's Kev, and this is Getting Started as a Music Artist, part four. In this video, we're gonna talk about the foundation of getting your album taken care of, beats and production. If you remember from the last video, we talked about budget. That's gonna come up here again, so let's talk about it. What are you willing to spend per beat or instrumental or composition? Are you looking to lease something to where you don't have complete ownership with it, but you can use it? Are you looking for a premium lease where you can get some track outs and some stems so the engineer that you choose can mix the song more cohesively? Or are you looking to buy it outright and have an exclusive license? Which means you own it, nobody else does. And if you get the right producer, they will not lease that beat to anybody else after you purchase the exclusive. Trust me, I've seen it happen before. It's kind of messed up. Some licenses start as low as $29.99. Some start at $49.99. For me, if you check my website, forthenovelty.com, they start at $59.99 and go up from there. However, I prefer to sell you something outright. So if you do want an exclusive, let's talk. The other thing you want to ask yourself, if you're looking to go the all-inclusive route, where you link up with the producer, and you track your vocals at home, they do the mixing, and the mastering of the whole song for you. And that price is included in the price of the beat. Are you gonna be purchasing a number of beats or are you just gonna do one at a time? Because remember, some producers will give you a price break if you're purchasing multiple. There's something you wanna ask these producers as you're talking to them. How do they handle their publishing on the back end? Meaning, are they going to retain a certain percentage of royalties on the back end once you purchase the beat? Because who knows, that beat you purchased today could blow up and be a Billboard Hot 100 top five song in the next six months. And that producer wants to make sure that if that happens, they're gonna get a little bit on the back end. And that's okay, you can negotiate that with the producer for what that percentage is. Okay, so again, let's think about it. What's your budget per beat? How many beats do you want? What type of beat do you want? Something to think about. I hope this video was helpful. As always, you can always get the Getting Started as a Music Artist guide free at the link in the description. I hope this was helpful. Have a good one.